Yo, what is up out there everyone? It's Roll Easy here. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to be going over the brand new gift cards to friends workaround, all right? Super easy to do, a little bit inconsistent, but we're going to go over all of that right after this message. If you're brand new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of my latest videos. If you're also interested in GTA 5 online modded accounts, go ahead and go to my latest upload and click on this link in the description. This will lead you to the website Digizani. This is the most trusted site to purchase cash and rank services on all platforms for GTA 5 online at reasonable prices. Don't forget once you're done shopping, add the discount code EEZY to save some money at the end of your checkout. Okay, so going on with the video, shout out to the founders, Lost Glitches and Vladdy Rad. Their names will be down in the description. What you're gonna need for this, start this glitch in an invite only session or a friends only. Both will work, I recommend a friends only, but in this video, we were in an invite, all right? So keep that in mind. What you need is a bunker. As the car receiver, you need a bunker, MOC with the personal vehicle storage, and an RH8 inside. That's the RH8 you see me driving right now. What I also need as the person receiving the car is a Fagio in any other garage other than the clubhouse, okay? Make sure it's in a car garage. Now, you need obviously one friend that's giving you a vehicle that you want. This could be an aircraft. Special vehicles still need to be tested, but we're sure that that one will work too. Now, this is the friend setup. What the friend needs to do is go ahead and go to this location on the map right by the big airfield in Blaine County. So these are the two job markers that we're going to be using. Now, if you can't see those on your map, just go to the hide options and change it to show all. Now, once you have you as the friend, you're the person giving the car, you want to go ahead and park the car you're giving your friend right on top of that pink job marker. OK, that pink job marker is where you want to park the vehicle you're giving your friend. Now, I recommend going back to your bunker, okay? Go back to your bunker and then start up this mission from the map, all right? Now, once you've gone ahead and started up that mission, you're gonna be sitting here AFK just for a little bit, all right? You're not really doing much, you're just waiting for your friend to kind of get glitched out. Now, if you're in an invite-only session like me, go ahead and send an invite through the party so your friend has one. That's what I'm doing right here in the video. If you're in a friends-only session, your friend can simply join you through the party, okay? No need for an invite. So that's why I said in the beginning, probably recommend doing this in a friends-only session. Now we're back to the car receiver. Car receiver, have the RH8 inside your MOC and go ahead and drive it out. Everything is in the bunker. We're in the bunker. We're solo right now doing this, okay? So at this point, what you want to do is go ahead and drive up to the blue circle, get the right D-pad option. And the point is you need to either join your friend through the party or through the invite that they're in the job that they're sitting in. Okay, you want to fully join it. Now you want to get that alert as the animation is happening. So I'm going to go ahead and join my friend right now. Count two seconds, hit right D-pad. The alert should come in right now. Accept it right away. And you want to fully go into the job. So you need to get that alert while the animation is happening. So find your timing, okay? Now, what you need to do once you're in here, you tell your friend to go ahead and kick you from the job, the job that they're just sitting in. You tell them to kick you. Once they've kicked you, you need to go ahead and run straight over to the car that you want to get. All right, this is my friend's car that he's giving me. So I'm going to hop into it and my friend needs to get out of that job that they're in and go into their MOC and send me an invite. Okay, so right now I'm waiting in their car and I have my phone open and I'm waiting for that MOC invite to come in. I need to accept it and then immediately spam right D-pad. Just like this. So I'm spamming right D-pad as long as or as long as I get, you know, up to this black screen just about. You can stop spamming. What you want to see happen is you actually fully load into the job. You see, just like this. So you actually want to load in the job now. It's not like the other gift cards to friends. Okay, so at this point, once you're able to back out, simply press circle or B and, and then confirm the alert and go ahead and back out of the job. Now that we're out of the job, immediately run to that car again and get in. Okay, get right in there and you should get sucked into a black screen okay so right now i'm just waiting i'm seeing if i'm gonna get sucked in boom all right i got sucked into a black screen if that doesn't happen you need to redo that part again from the beginning now this is what you should see okay you should see yourself spawn on top of the rh8 in your moc or right next to it but the, the rh8 needs to be in there if it's not in there if you spawn in and there's no vehicle in there whatsoever you need to start back from the beginning as well okay you must hit this part to continue with the glitch okay so now that we are at this part we've spawned in the moc with the rh8 i'm gonna go ahead and leave on foot okay don't drive that rh8 out at all leave the moc on foot and now we're gonna be leaving the bunker on foot 
So that's the first half of the glitch, basically. What that's going to allow us to do is now get frozen behind the MOC and pause the an well freeze the animation, basically. So once I get out of my bunker, what I'm going to do now is remember I said have a Fagio or any like you know bike. Uh, Sanchez is also work. I've used that as well. Go ahead and open up your MC menu and call out a Fagio that's in a garage, not the clubhouse. Remember. So I've called out this Fagio right here. I'm going to go ahead and take this into the bunker. This is going to be the vehicle that we're using to get glitched out. Now, your friend needs to get back into that same job, that contact mission, all right? Have them sitting in that job. And you can have an invite, remember? Or you can have your friend just join you through the party if you're in a friends-only session. Okay, but that's the setup right now. While you're doing this, you want your friend to get back into that same contact mission next to that pink race, okay? So, my friend's in that job. I'm going to simply position myself over here and... I don't, if you want to park at the same angle that I was at, go ahead, but this is where I was getting frozen. So just drive up here, press right D-pad, you should get a full alert. Go ahead and just accept that. Accept the full alert and then you're going to notice that you will be completely frozen, okay? Now, right now you won't be able to move your camera, press pause, nothing like that. Alright, you're totally frozen. This is where you want to go ahead and join your friend that's in that job, alright? That same contact mission. So I'm using an invite. But like I said, you can join through the party as well. So I'm going to go ahead and join Lost, who's sitting in that job for me. Now I'm going to get the alert and I'm going to join all the way through. I'm going to go ahead and accept it. Now, once I accept it, the friend is going to do the same thing they did before. The friend's going to kick me out. All right. For those of you that don't know how to kick from a job, this is what the friend is doing. While you're joining in, your friend is going to go ahead and go to view join players info. Okay. So you're going to see right here, view join players info. Go ahead and hover over your friend's name and click on it and you can hit kick just like that. That's how you kick your friend out of the job for those of you who don't know. Now, this is what's happening right now. I'm joining Lost Job. He just kicked me out with that method I just showed you right before this clip. And I'm going to spawn down right by the car and the pink race. Have your friend send you another MOC invite, right? Have them get in the MOC and send you another invite quick. What you want to do is get in here, accept the MOC invite through the phone, and then quickly spam right D-pad. Like I said, sometimes it will kick you out of the car, sometimes not. But this is the first time you need to spam it, okay? Well, it's if you don't count the other time, but this right here is how we're gonna receive the car. So you do this one time, you wanna spam, or you wanna spam right D-pad and actually load into the race, okay? Once we've loaded into the race, I'm just gonna go ahead and back out. Okay, this is where you need to rush as well because sometimes it could work here, sometimes not. But usually this part, you have to do it two times over, this spamming right D-pad, okay? So we're going to spawn back over by the car. Hurry up and get inside of the car. Now, you want your friend to get out of that job and go back into their MOC. That's why I recommended that your friend be at the bunker because they're going to be going in and out of the job and the MOC. So now my friend is going to go ahead and send me an MOC invite. I'm going to accept it and spam right D-pad while in the car on top of the circle. Once again, I got kicked out. That's okay. This is the one that's going to get us the car after this. Okay, once we back out of this job, we will be able to get the car, and you're going to see right now. So right now I'm loading into the job, and all I need to do is once I finally, you know, the camera stops zooming down to the ground, I can simply back out of the job by pressing B or circle and confirming the alert. You do it fast enough, you don't even see the alerts. So I've spawned back down. Hurry up. Get in the car now. Hurry up and get in the car. Once I've gotten in the car, it should get hit on a black screen, but you need to do it quick. Sometimes you spawn a little far, but you got to get into that car quick before the black screen happens. Now you should get sucked into the MOC with your friend's vehicle standing on top of it. And that's how you receive a car with this workaround. Okay. So I went into really, really, you know, depth like information for this glitch because we tested it a bunch and this is what i found out to be more consistent what you do need to do what you don't need to do stuff like that okay so this is the car in here it's fully saved remember if you're doing this as a money glitch you definitely need custom plates you you and your friend both need the same custom plate but most people are going to be doing this for collectible items to collect cars with benny's rooms uh as far as we know xbox does work for, you know it's i don't see why i wouldn't i'm going to start testing it right after i get this video done but i don't see why it wouldn't work on xbox on Xbox, we're not using anything different than we are on PS4 for this one, but I will be testing it. Check the pinned comment for some updated info for the Xbox guys, but like I said, I don't see there being a problem, but we're going to test it just in case. Now, I hope everybody enjoyed the video. Shout out to the founders once again. That's going to be it for me. My name is Roll Easy. Please subscribe to the channel by pressing that big red button if you're brand new. 
Turn on post notifications and drop a fat like on this video and the rest of my videos for the freshest and the most informative dope GTA 5 online content. We are on the road to 50,000 subscribers. Peace out.